sting was called Operation ADC Express. The intent was to capture men using the Internet to solicit sex from minors. It lasted three days in the week before Christmas, and Fairfax County Police say that 10 men were arrested and charged. News Force Paul Wagner has the story. The sting was a simple one. Use detectives posing as children to see how many people would engage with what they thought was a child online and then make plans to meet for sex. For 10 men, their meetups did not go as planned. The vast majority of these grown men who are really sick criminals uh, broke down in tears. But the life of a child that they either uh, plan to plan to uh, prey upon or would later prey upon are, are saved. So it, it, it's tough, tough work that these detectives do. Court records show one man used the app Grinder and another used Telegraph to make contact with the detectives posing as children. In many cases, photos were exchanged, including some showing private parts of the men seeking sex with children. I'm sad to report the success of our operation, uh, but I'm also satisfied that 10 predators uh, are in jail this holiday season. In some cases, police say the meetups were arranged within hours of the men making contact with the detectives. Fish in a barrel. So fish in a barrel. Um, you know, our detectives are really careful during the operation to represent themselves as children. There's no gotcha game um, at, associated with this at all. Records News 4 has been able to look at here at the Fairfax County Courthouse show that these men come from a variety of backgrounds. One's an Army veteran who says he has a wife and a daughter. Another's a yoga instructor. Some of the men say they work as waiters and bartenders. One works in construction. Another says he's living out of his car. And one man that police arrested said he's a journalist from Qatar who's been in this country for five days living in a hotel. That man, police say, is 38-year-old Mohammed Ellen Feely, who told detectives he had plans to head to the U.K. on Christmas Eve. Police are advising parents to go on the website of the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children and look at the apps the predators are using. And there was more advice from police. I've got two kids, uh, teenagers at home, and... One of the things that we don't allow them to do is take their phone to bed with them at night because that's the prime opportunity. There's no supervision. At the same news conference, police introduced their newest crime fighting tool, Delaware, an English lab who can detect electronic devices, devices police say predators keep and hide their illegal and illicit content. In Fairfax, Paul Wagner, News 4. Police say the ADC in Operation ADC Express stands for Adult Detention Center. It's the second time in recent months that police have used detectives in a sting like this.